Hey guys, my name is Mzaza123 and before the video starts guys, I want to quickly say thank you to Thunder for letting us be on TSG. It means so much to me that you're giving me an opportunity and so many others an opportunity as well. Like, dude, you're a sick YouTuber. And also before um, I start getting into this topic guys, um, this video, it is my first and only uh, nuclear on uh, Black Ops 3, so please enjoy and let's get into it. So, um, yeah, this uh, video, guys, it's going to be about um, how much we have spent on the Call of Duty franchise, like, over the years, like, just Call of Duty. So what um, brought me to thinking about this was um, the black market supply drops in uh, Black Ops 3. Because when uh, COD points got introduced, I'm like, nah, I'm not ever going to uh, pay money for this. Like, no, it's it's not worth it. I don't care if you're putting bloody dildos in there. Not that I want dildos, but fucking, I'm, I'm not bloody paying any money. So that's that. Which made me think, I'm not going to be paying money for COD points, but how much have I actually spent on Call of Duty altogether? Okay guys, before I start listing prices, it's very important to know that I'm Australian, and the Australian dollar is a lot higher than the American dollar, so let's get into it. Alright, there's a lot of Call of Duty, so prepare yourself guys. So I went all the way back to 2009, yeah. So all the way back to 2009 is when I purchased my first Call of Duty, COD 5. COD 5, World at War, $70. Modern Warfare 2, $80. DLC 1, $20. DLC 2, $20. During Modern Warfare 2, I got COD 4 because people were saying it was good, so I'm like, alright, might as well. Complete waste of time because it was hacked and it was really laggy, so... Anyway, $40 for that. There was a PC Steam sale for COD 4. Um, I got that for $20. The original Black Ops, $100. DLC 1, $20. DLC 2, $20. DLC 3, $20. DLC 4, $20. Modern Warfare 3, $100. Season Pass for that, $70. Black Ops 2, $90. And this is a bit interesting here for the DLC, because um, if you didn't know, on PS3, I'm not sure about Xbox, but um, for PS3, you can like go on your friend's account and download it from there. So what we did was um, one person would download it, then the other one would download it off them and it would end up just paying half the price for each DLC, so, you know, be sustainable, kids. Anyway, so $10 for all the full DLCs there, so it ended up paying half the price rather than 80 Uh, sorry for the intrusion, guys. While editing this video, I noticed this Semtex, which was about two pin dicks away from getting me. Holy crap, if that have gotten me, I would have just, I don't know, scream. That's what I've done, scream. Anyway, continue on the video. So, making it... DLC 1, $10, DLC 2, $10, DLC 3, $10, DLC 4, $10. <laughs> so after Black Ops 2, guys, I actually didn't get um, the next Call of Duty's um, Ghosts and Advanced Warfare, so I saved a lot of money there. But um, but don't worry, I got Black Ops 3, and that was $78. And then I got the Season Pass, which was 65 And just a quick tip, guys, if a guy is chasing you down with a bow and arrow that explodes, just run. This guy was hunting me down. Like crazy. Now, drum roll. The total for all the money that I've spent on Call of Duty all together, out of my money, and some of my parents' money, $873, guys. So, come on, that is just scary as fuck. <laughs> what the hell? Far out. I could have bought like a million pretzels with that amount of money. Jesus Christ. But let's just say I was um one of those kids who like literally spends money on every single thing there is for COD. So imagine if I got Ghost and it's DLC, that would have been like over $100 and then I got Advanced Warfare plus the DLC and plus like people, some people get supply drops and then it just more money. Could have been like over $1,000 for other people. So just think about it. It's scary stuff guys. I recommend you do the same thing just to see how much you've wasted, I mean spent on Call of Duty. So I hope this uh, video helps you Reconsider like what you spend your money on because honestly, this is just a game guys You don't need you don't need to be spending your your money on digital items for digital guns and and Customization special things like just come on guys save your money The world's a scary place you know you need to you need to spend your money on like real things like cars and and houses like for fuck's sake <laughs> Oh got, got a bit carried away there. So yes guys if you like the video like the video <laughs> and comment and I'll definitely get back to you and yes, see you later.